How's your jaw? Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... What? I... Did you rehearse that move? No. Only in my mind. <laughs> so, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it, Guess I never realized. That I can kick your ass? Yeah, I guess. No, I never realized what your life must have been like. On your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Kids in foster care fight a lot. I learned how to defend myself. I'd say. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? There's something off about me. I know what other people are feeling. I can see these auras around them. And if they feel strongly enough, if they're angry or sad or afraid, I feel it too. And then I lose control. And this has happened? For a long time. Like Mac. I felt all that anger like it was my own. I think it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. It's more than that. He wasn't just angry at you. He's angry at himself. He thinks he's going to lose Riley. Did Riley tell you that? No. No one told me that. I just... feel it. You sure it's not just... You know. It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds, or stress, or trauma, or whatever. 
It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? It doesn't work like that. It's only when you feel really strong emotions. Oh. I don't expect you to believe me. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. I guess I am. Dude, you have superpowers. <laughs> You're fucking with me, right? I'm serious. Did you listen to anything I just said? This is terrible. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... I have no idea what's going on with people half the time. Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there, I mean, that's, that's really special. Special. That's really your take on all this? Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? But it doesn't matter what's going on. I'm here for you. Don't forget that. Tell me about the guitar. Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. Surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? Hey, is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. He was, but I haven't seen him in a while. You don't think... Maybe? Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now. Let's go. Ethan! Come on, pick up, pick up. Alex. This way. since I was up here. Should I be, I don't know, freaking out right now? 
In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Any luck? In touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey, you good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? Hey. We're gonna find him. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, thanks again for your help. Could have been a lot worse if you hadn't kept me in the loop. Of course. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. I can do that. How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? I got you. I got you. It's okay. You're okay. Oh, God. Oh, God, we're alive. Is that everybody? I need a head count. The real monster here is underage drinking. You don't realize until you're up close. Mining equipment is super murdery. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Ryan won't let his fear get in the way. I'm glad he's here. Alex warned me. I could have stopped this. I'm such a fucking fuck up. Gabe cares about Ethan so much. We have to find. What happened here? Massive cave in. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. God. Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. Huh. Same logo. Did Ethan base his comic on this place? Okay. Okay. If the wall is an illusion... Nothing obvious. Maybe we should... Notice anything? No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds like the mind of me. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. There. The silo. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Let's take a look then. Okay. Ethan based his comic on this place. Maybe I should compare his drawings with other stuff in the area. I think I'm looking for something closer to that big building. Wait, 
so did Ethan? Oh man. I think there's like a side door back there. I don't know. I can guess there might be. Give me a hand. Okay. You figured that out from a comic book. I'm gonna try to get the lights on. You try to figure out where Ethan went. Ethan must have come through here. How did he get out? I'm 100% sure that if I picked up the receiver, there'd be like a demon voice on the other end. Anne, you okay? I'm sorry to call you at work. I just came home from the doctor. I couldn't wait for you to come home. Baby doll? I, I'm pregnant, Jed. Have I got some good news for you. What? Go with red. It's always red. Kind of want to push all the buttons. Also, kind of scared to push any of the buttons. Ugh. Let's hope omens aren't really a thing. Be careful walking around in here, okay? Noted. Ugh. Worse than sleeping on the ground. Nope. Thanor doesn't battle any bed bugs. I'm not confident this is gonna work. Ow! That yeah, was worth a shot, I guess. Ethan must have passed through some other way. Let me see what I can figure out. So much stuff just left behind. If Ethan didn't get out through the door, how did he get out? This thing has seen better days. scary old building. Please don't collapse while we're inside you. Thanks. Wasn't in the comic. Maybe it's full of Twinkies. Those never go bad, right?
Ethan must have gone upstairs. Pretty sure Ethan climbed these stairs. Okay, I'll stay out. Wasn't in the comic. We passed caution like an hour ago. The silo. We're getting close. Ethan made the jump from here to the conveyor belt? Oof. Think I'll find another way through. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Yikes. Heads up! You figured out the door! Yeah. Turns out you gotta open it. Who knew? Not in the comic. So this place was a death trap when it was operational too. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. What took you so long? You never forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. Where to next, Alex? Thanor looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. If we can just... There. That's where he's heading. That's by the ravine. Shit. Let's go!